my current kind of interest or hobby, um, well, I should preface by saying that I'm really into jigsaw puzzles and things where you kind of have to like put things together and solve. So when I saw this, I saw it on TikTok, actually. It's some girl was like making this little micro block um, teddy bear thing. And if you're like into Legos, it's kind of like kind of like like Legos, but way smaller. Like the pieces are way smaller. And she put it together and it looked so cool. Like she had a whole display. So when I saw that, I went on TikTok shop and usually like, you know, I'm kind of like leery of stuff like that, like buying stuff, you know, that I just see on the internet. But I was influenced, I have to admit. And I decided to buy um, a couple of bears. And I mean, I'll show like um, a stock photo of what it's supposed to look like, but the instructions are like, there are no words. So, I mean, literally no words. It's just a page of like diagrams and like showing you like which blocks to piece together so you get like baggies of like all these tiny little blocks and you just have to build each layer one by one until it comes together and there are no real instructions just diagrams so i feel like anybody could understand understand this i mean the instructions are actually way easy way easier to understand than like your standard ikea furniture instructions like these are detailed you know so it comes in comes in a box so everything comes in a box and it's just like baggy so it came in like this bag was entirely full up with colored blocks when i first received them and it was just two two giant bags of all of these blocks and i've gone i've used most of them and i still have more to go because i haven't finished my project yet but like bags of blocks and let me just show you what the blocks look like because I don't know if anybody's ever shown this on YouTube. Or I'm just not on that side of YouTube. But each block has like a little ridge and you can kind of like, the blocks have little pieces. I don't know if it'll show if I can get close up enough, but um, the blocks just kind of interlock, like slide in and interlock and that's how you um, put them together. And then they also stack up like these little round ridges, kind of like, you know, like Legos and they'll snap into place. And I mean, if you make a mistake, they're not hard to disassemble. I mean, they just slide right back out like that and they can unsnap. But yeah, so that's what that looks like. And I've been working on it for a couple of um, weeks now. And I mean, if you were really into it and obsessed with putting it together, I'm sure it would take like a like less than a week to put together. But, you know, I just put in some from, um, few minutes here and there for whenever I have free time. And let me just show you how far I've gotten. So this is my rainbow bear and they come um, in lots of different colors and patterns, but this one was the one that spoke to me and this is how far I've gotten. And as you can see, it's pretty big. I mean, this is my hands and I mean, I still have the head and shoulders to go, but I've put this together layer by layer and it is hollow in the, in the middle, but I mean, this is a pretty decent weight. I would say it's at least a pound so far, maybe more. And I mean, if you make a mistake, I think you would you'd be able to see at once and you'd be able to take it apart. But so far, I think all my blocks and colors are in the right locations. And I think I followed the directions pretty well. But yeah, I'm almost I'm almost there. I'm like, I probably have a third of the way left to go. But that is how my rainbow bear is looking. And sometimes they get a little loose and just kind of push them back together. But I mean, for the most part, they all stick together really well. And I mean, oh, so, and I, I just want to say, like, this isn't even like the only size. They come in multiple sizes, like smaller ones. And there's even like a huge ass one that's like double the size. But I thought, I was like, oh my God, like I want to do that. But where would I even put that, you know? Like I need room to put this somewhere. And I think I can put this on top of like a bookcase or something. But for a bear, like the big one, I wouldn't know where to put that. That's just too huge. But I do kind of want to make one of those, you know? But they're also more expensive. This one I think I got for like um, less than $20. And it's a good project. I mean, I wouldn't recommend it for like really small kids because these might be like a choking hazard. But for like um, like 10 and up, I don't know. I don't know what the age requirement for this is, like the limitations are. But I think I would have been into this, I think, when I was in elementary school. Like, you know, third grade, fourth grade, kind of like that. 
because I was always, I've always been into puzzles. And this is something I think young me would enjoy, would have enjoyed. I mean, I still enjoy the things I enjoyed back then. And yeah, I mean, it's a nice change up from the usual jigsaw puzzle. And it does like, it's, it is fun. Like, because the instructions are so vague, but also, I mean, vague with detail at the same time, you kind of just have to piece together what you need to do on yourself by yourself. And yeah, but just want to show off how far I've gotten. Um, but yeah, highly recommend this. I think you can also get it on Amazon, although like the stock on Amazon is kind of, kind of limited. I had better luck finding um, what I wanted. Like um, I wanted the rainbow bear because I think this one was the most challenging of all. Like I didn't want just a plain like single color bear or like one that was just like t um, two tone or three tones. Like this one I felt like was a little more challenging for me because of all the different colors and making it look right. So I want this one. Um, but anyway, yeah, I think there were more options, more sellers on TikTok shop than there were on Amazon that I found. So because, you know, I tried finding like the best deal and I did see some on Amazon, but they were very limited on the variety. Like the ones I wanted were all sold out. So I went with this one. I found a seller on like TikTok shop. I found the, the one that was selling it for like the least amount of money. So I went with that and it was like shipped directly from like TikTok or whatever. So I want this. Hopefully they don't steal my credit card information because this was like my first ever purchase from TikTok. But yeah, kind of pleased. Um, almost there. I don't have time all the time to work on it, but whenever I, like I said, whenever I have a free moment, I don't like I spend like a couple of minutes on this. I mean, I would say like each row, maybe like a row like that takes about like 10 minutes. So, you know, 10, 20, 30, 30 at least 30 minutes, maybe probably less. I would... I usually do about three rows um, a night before I go to bed. So yeah, it's been a while. 